welcome dear students i am professor n k jadhav from department of chemistry hhm college nasik right from this lecture i will teach you a course cctp 9 that is cho 352 stereochemistry and asymmetric synthesis of organic compounds which is uh, implemented by sayudri bai phule pune university from the academic year 2020 so friends uh, before uh, starting the actual syllabus uh, i would like to uh, start the basic concept concept which are related to the stereochemistry we know that when atoms combine together there is a formation of molecule this molecule has different properties than the parent atoms from which it is synthesis and these properties molecular properties depends on the different parameters different parameters <coughs> so properties of molecules depends on a different parameters some of the parameters are geometry structure etc suppose we consider one example that is uh, the molecule formula is supposed to be c2h6 having two compounds one is ch3ch2oh another compound ch3och3 so these two compounds one is a ethyl alcohol second one is a dimethyl ether dimethyl ether molecule formula is same but having two different structures these alcohol this alcohol and dimethyl ether having a different properties this ethyl alcohol is soluble in water dimethyl ether is insoluble in water another example suppose we consider another example first one is a malic acid and second one is a fumaric acid fumaric acid this malic acid is essential to plants and animals but fumaric acid is toxic to the plants both compounds having same molecular formula that is C four H four O four molecular formula is same, but two structures. One is malic acid, another is fumaric acid. One is essential, another is toxic. So structure, geometry determines the properties. That's why the structure and property study is very important thing in organic chemistry. and that's why we consider the stereochemistry term what is that stereochemistry before actually start with this <coughs> stereochemistry first of all see the basic terms which are related to this particular stereochemistry that is known as isomer just i have mentioned here one is a fumaric acid i again write here the structure first one is a malic acid and second one is a fumaric acid both having the same molecular formula but they have slight differences in their structure malic acid and second one is a 
fumaric acid. <coughs> Molecular formula is same that is C4, H4, O4, but structures are different. So, isomer are the two or more compounds, two or more compounds having same having same molecular formula same molecular formula but different structures but different structures are known as isomers and the phenomenon is called as a isomerism. This is an example molecule formula is C4H4O4 but having a different geometry one is a cis another is trans. Another example is just I have mentioned here that is molecule formula is C2H6O can have two structures C2 5 C3 CS3 CH2OH means ethyl alcohol and another is a dimethyl ether. Molecular formula is same, but structures are different. So, this study is important because the structural features are different. So, isomers, these are the compounds, two or <coughs> these are the two or more compounds having same molecular formula, but different structure arrangements or different structures. So, the study of isomers are important that's upon, that's why we first of all see the types of isomerism types of isomerism and we these basic terms we are known from FIBSC. So, isomers are classified into two important categories first one is a constitutional isomerism and second one stereo isomerism and the isomers are stereo isomer. So, isomers constitutional isomer and stereo isomer. These two categories are based on whether the arrangement or the arrangement of atoms is in same sequence or different sequence. Sequence of atom is same atom same sorry in this case it is different and in this case it is the same. So, sequence of atom in case of constitutional isomerism is different that is why these are also called as a structural isomers and in case of stereo isomer the sequence of atom is same, but three dimensional structure three dimensional structure is different means attachment of atom to particular atom another atom. This sequence is same, but in three dimensional way the arrangement is different. So, these stereo isomer having a different three dimensional arrangement. First of all see the constitutional isomers, the constitutional isomers are further categorized into the chain isomer. In case of chain isomer only the chain is different. For example, we consider n-butane and neobin uh, sorry isobutane, n-butane and isobutane. The molecule formula is same but the structural chain is different isobutane that is why they are called as a chain isomers. Second example sorry second further category of this constitutional isomerism is position isomers. In case of position isomer the position of any atom or particular function group in the chain is different. For example, we consider suppose CS3, CH2, CH double bond CH2 means it is a 
ब्यूटीन बट इट्स वन ब्यूटीन इट्स वन ब्यूटीन अनदर एग्जाम्पल अनदर आइसोमर इज सी एस थ्री सी एच डबल बॉन्ड सी एच सी एस थ्री इट्स टू ब्यूटीन मीन्स ही इन दीज एग्जाम इन दीज टू एग्जाम्पल्स इन दीज टू आइसोमर फंक्शनल ग्रुप इज अल्किन फंक्शनल ग्रुप इज अल्किन एंड द पोजिशन ऑफ अल्किन ग्रुप इन दिस केस फर्स्ट सेकेंड वन इज टू पोजिशन सो दिस इज द सेकेंड वी कैन से सेकेंड टाइप ऑफ आइसोमेरिज्म विच इज ऑब्जर्ड इन कंस्टिट्यूशनल आइसोमेरिज्म लेट अस कंसिडर थर्ड थर्ड आइसोमेरिज्म विच इज ऑब्जर्ड इन और थर्ड टाइप ऑफ आइसोमर्स विच आर ऑब्जर्ड इन केस ऑफ कंस्टिट्यूशनल आइसोमर इज द फंक्शनल ग्रुप आइसोमेरिज्म और फंक्शनल ग्रुप आइसोमर the functional group in case of functional group isomer suppose we consider general example we know this the molecule formula is c2h6o but the structures are two different structures one is dimethyl ether another is ethanol functional group is totally different so such type of isomers are called as a functional group isomers next one is tautomerism in case of tautomerism only the some only the difference is that in two isomer small atoms some small atoms changes their position the change in two isomer is only the difference in the position of atoms for example we suppose we consider ch3ch double bond c oh and ch3 it's called this is called as enol and it's isomer ch3 ch2 co ch3 it's a keto so position of hydrogen only the position of hydrogen is changed in these two isomers one is enol it is another isomer is keto position of hydrogen position is only change in these two isomers so these constitutional isomers are divided into different categories such as chain isomer position isomer functional group isomer and tautomerism okay so these are the <coughs> these are the further classic classification of constitutional isomers now let us see the stereo isomerism what is meant by stereo isomerism and their further classification we know that stereo isomers are nothing but the isomers having the different structures in three dimensional way sequence of atom is same but but the sequence of uh, but the three dimensional structure is different they may be configurational isomer or conformational isomers or conformational isomers this dividation is takes place on the basis of whether the free rotation at carbon carbon bond is takes place or not in case of in case of conformational isomerism or conformational isomers free carbon carbon rotation takes place but in case of these free carbon carbon rotation is not takes place only this is the difference between conformational isomer and configurational isomer so in case of configurational isomer these further are divided these configurational isomers are further divided into two types one is uh, <coughs> cis trans uh, sorry one is a geometrical isomer geometrical isomer or isomerism phenomenon and another is uh, optical isomerism optical isomerism and uh, this is depend so again <coughs> this further distinction carried out on the basis of whether the carbon carbon double bond rotation is restricted or carbon carbon means in this case carbon carbon free rotation is not takes place but why this carbon carbon rotation is not takes place whether it is based on the 
because of the some restrictions of carbon carbon double bond in case of geometrical isomerism cis and trans isomerism is observed cis and trans i have given example that is cis example for example cis this malic acid and trans that is fumaric acid so one isomer if try to convert into the another isomer such type of conversion is not easier in cis trans isomerism because to convert cis isomerism into trans trans into the cis we have to break this double bond until and unless the breaking is not takes place one is not converted to another one okay so that's why this is called as a geometrical isomerism and one example related to this cis or trans isomerism optical isomerism it is only because of the just like a mirror and image isomerism mirror image isomerism mirror image isomerism okay <coughs> uh, just like you were in any schumer like this these are the examples in any schumer diastereomers these are the examples of optical isomerism conformational isomerism conformational isomerism we know that the example is the cyclohexane cyclohexane has different conformations such as chair conformation boat conformation then twist boat conformation half chair conformation like this so these conformational isomers are because of this free rotation of carbon carbon bond at room temperature okay so this is a general classification of isomers depending on their geometry and related things okay so after this complete isomerism phenomenon we will uh, <coughs> look towards the main uh, stereochemistry of related cyclohexane chemistry okay we today we stop here thank you